What's good, y'all? It's your boy Rod, and I'm back with another video. Now, all y'all have been seeing my videos that I've been doing with my niece, and she been um, she basically told me that my music was trash. She was saying, she said a lot of stuff. She been saying like, "Yo, you should stop this. Delete the music. Just don't even do this no more. Why are you doing this? Why did I even start in the first place? Delete my album. I just dropped my new album called Came So Far. Delete my album." You know, don't she don't want to hear any of it. She said it sound better listening to it on mute. She been saying some real crazy stuff. And I made a video and I showed her the music and she was saying it was bad. And then at the end, I went to the trunk. Now that that clip, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all the clip right here. What you doing? It sounds so good. For real? Listening to it on mute right now. What? I couldn't have done nothing better to make it better? You could have dropped it into your deleted files. Maddie, this is my career, Maddie. <laughs> Fuck. That clip been getting a little controversy because I also dropped it on TikTok and some shorts on YouTube and Instagram, all that. It's been getting some controversy and a lot of people been asking me Yo, you put the baby in the trunk? You put her in the trunk? Why'd you put her in the trunk? What happened? All this stuff. A lot of people been saying all this stuff. And they've been questioning me. And first of all, I think it's I think it's kind of disrespectful and crazy to even ask me if I put my niece in the trunk. You know. That's that you know, I don't know. What y'all think? What y'all think I would put my niece in the trunk? You know, so that was just part of the that was part of the controversy. Everybody saying, "Oh, you putting her in the trunk." People taking her side, saying, "You know, she able to have her opinion. She could say what she want. She could do all this." But you know, you can't always say what you want. You can't just you know you can't just it, that is not how this works. So you know what? To everybody who was questioning me and asking me if I put my niece in the trunk, she only eight years old, by the way. I'm going to just show y'all. I thought the only way I can actually come out on top in this situation is if I just show y'all what really happened. So I'm going to just go ahead and show y'all so y'all can look for yourselves. Show y'all this. Since y'all like to play with me, question me, you know, kind of call me names and all that. I'm going to just go ahead and I'm going to show y'all exactly what y'all wanted to see and what y'all been asking for. Come on. They over here questioning me. They over here questioning me about you asking me why I put you in the trunk. Come on. I'm gonna need you to go ahead and explain this to him. They're not gonna take my word for it. So you know you got some explaining to do. How you how you how how you you feeling being in the trunk? So why would you disrespect me in front of all these people? You call my music trash. I told you, you can you can have your opinion. It don't matter. I'm not going. I'm not going to fault you for having your opinion. If you don't like the music, you don't have to like the music. But you out here disrespecting me in front of all these people. You got people looking at me crazy. You got people. You, you got people feeding into what you saying. Everybody is sitting here saying that my music is trash all because of what you said. And then you got me looking even more crazy because now they asking me. Did I put you in the trunk? I mean, I know I did put you in the trunk, but why would they think I put you in the trunk? They, they think that because they think I'm crazy and they think all these things because of what you've been saying about me on the internet. And you think it's funny the whole time. I made the video and you was ignoring me and you, and you still doing it. Why are you still doing it? What, what are you, why are you? Why are you still ignoring me? I've been, I've been asking you a question. Why, why are you disrespecting me in front of all these people? Now she's trying to act sleep. She acting, bro. She keep on doing this, trying to make it seem like I'm the crazy one this whole time. <sighs> bro. Like, what am I supposed to do at this point? What am I supposed to do that now... You over here, you playing victim. You the one that's trying to end my music career. And then now, you want to act sleep. You want to act like the victim. You playing the victim when the whole time, 
I'm the one that been getting getting done crazy. You've been doing all this to me. I was I dropped my album and I've been trying to, you know, I've been trying to just get y'all input. And then you had an opinion, and that's cool. I told you, you can be honest. That's what I asked for. But you, you sitting there, and you started calling my music trash. Like I said, it was cool at first. It was an opinion. But then you kept going on and on and on. Now you got people asking me, did I put you in the trunk? And then I, and I tried to keep that away from everybody. I didn't want to show everybody. I didn't want to show everybody. But they keep asking, so I had no choice but to show it. And you're still playing victim because I'm asking you questions. I'm saying, why did you let? Why are you disrespecting me on the internet? And you're still doing it. Now you want to act sleep. It's cool. It's whatever, bro. He got an alibi and he want to buy the no law. I know it's fucked up, but he won't hesitate to go send a nigga to a law. Young nigga with rag ties in the back of a Maybach. Put in work, whole fan gonna eat. I've been going to work on eat. All grind, no sleep. I stay low key. Uh. And you know I be rolling with killers, they really gorillas. Uh, only the realest, you know that we winning. I feel like I've been.